You're watching Smart Women, Smart Ideas, where I interview entrepreneurial women who have come up with distinct and unique concepts and ideas that we like to showcase so that maybe you can learn from it, maybe you could follow their path, and maybe we could all grow and make some money. My husband and I co-wrote a script about an all-female rock band. Yeah. Uh, yes. And it's, okay. they're getting back together 10 years after a very, very nasty breakup. All right. And it's a dark comedy, a drama, and there's a lot of original music. And we, and we wrote it a couple of years ago. And so now we're doing it ourselves. It's an independent project. We're making a pilot. Why it, couldn't you do this 10 years ago? Uh, the technology is different now. I mean, right and affordable. Now, affordable. Everybody, everybody can shoot it. And so there's a need for content. And then there's a lot of outlets for it. There's uh, broadband, cable, Yahoo, Google, YouTube. So you can self-distribute it if you would like. We're, you know, we're 3,000 miles away from Hollywood. And we are not there on a day-to-day -day basis. So we can give our scripts to our agent. He can show them around. We'll come in for the meetings, et cetera. This way, we can actually give them a product. What are you doing to um, help raise money? You, you mentioned something to me earlier about Kickstarter and some uh, other stuff. Indiegogo right now. Indiegogo. Yes, we're on Indiegogo, and we're raising funds. You know, you, it costs money to put together a project, and we're doing it on a micro budget. Um, but we, we do, you know, you have to rent cameras and lease, um, you know, locations and insurance right. and that. So it's, a, it's on Indiegogo right now, Indiegogo.com. So people love yes. Women Rock and yes. they want this oh, yeah. program we, to come to air to help you. Yes. You need to uh, go to Indiegogo. Them. Indiegogo. Yeah. Com. Desire the TV show. Desire the TV <laughs> show. Have you cast people already? Yeah, we've, we've already cast a couple of people. One of them is Kathy Richardson. She is a singer songwriter out of Chicago. Right. She has an incredible voice. On her face, I see how I can be God, I've been a rocker just as long as I can remember. <laughs> I, um, when From I, cradle, cradle? Yes, rocking. well, about 12 years old, I decided that I, I heard my first heart record and <laughs> I saw them on the cover with, they were dressed like gypsies holding out, you know, crystal balls. And I was like, oh, you I, I want to be them. What, what's cool about this show is that they're casting actual women who rock and we're going to be uh, contributing uh, creatively as well, which I, is an amazing opportunity to me. When I met Ramona and we started talking about the project, I immediately started having these uh, ideas about how to write the song. And we had one phone call and I put it down and immediately wrote the song, wrote the lyrics. It was up that night, right in the melody. Why did it come so quickly? It came so quickly because it was the, the characters are so defined, which is a credit to them. This is something that I really enjoyed doing, it, taking just a little time, a little bit of time to get a big message across. You, you've worked for news agencies, you've written sitcoms, you've done all sorts of things. Um, now you're writing full time, um, but you take time to consult, right? You help who, what? these men in suits that do the <laughs> nightly business report and they can't talk to the camera. What, who are you helping? I, I'm using my, I've spent over 20 years in television and entertainment, talk and news. So I'm using all that experience and I started my own business. I, I'm a media consultant and I've been consulting with financial services company, media buying company, uh, independent, uh, small startups, mm -hmm. uh, entrepreneurs, which is really actually who, a lot of fun. Who, who, do you find needs you the most? Well, everybody needs me a little bit differently. Right. Some, some, somebody who can stand in front of 500 people and talk about their company may not be able to sit across from somebody and tell that same story in, in a, a two minute interview. Right. So I can help a CEO do that. And then a small startup, they don't have the background they're they're new and they're busy trying to raise money so i might give them some media advice on you know places to reach out for marketing mm -hmm. and 
public relations. Well, it should be interesting, and yeah. it's glad that people can help you. I mean, the, yeah, it's, $5 it, is it's, helpful. You it's know? incredible. We, we actually need Bill Gates. Ha we've had <laughs> I mean, We nice. do need Bill Gates. Bill, yes, Bill, come here. <laughs> It'd be nice. Yeah. But, but um, it's, what's been incredible, though, is that we've struck a chord with a lot of women uh, business women who are in the music industry. We had uh, Daisy Rock Guitars donate a guitar to the project oh, right. yeah. so we could use that as a product perk. placement or yeah a little bit yeah a little but bit. that's good but that's what you can yeah. offer you yeah. know as an entrepreneur yeah. as a person working yeah. a small budget you have to look exactly. for ways to give back to make it you know mutually beneficial yeah. right it's wow, really that's incredible. amazing yeah. so it's indiegogo.com indiegogo.com Indiegogo. desire the tv Go -go. show yeah <laughs>